Yeah, hello and welcome to the lovely Silverstone circuit for round 9 of the F1 game DP C League. And yeah, Silverstone always provides a good and a good action packed race. And we're here in qualifying, in the dry qualifying. Um, after uh, after wet qualifying uh, in Spielberg and flat through the first corner and also flat through the second corner and our first breaking point is turn three a little bit late but that will not compromise our line through turn four which is uh, about now a good exit is very important that was a very very good exit so um, a very good first sector um, will be very very difficult to come near my PB because that was N actually not entirely clean but I was aiming for um, 30, uh, 30 flats and 30.1 so that should be um, clearly possible now through Brooklands and Luffield the exit here was also quite good a little bit cautious we were there but but uh, shouldn't have cost me too much time now Cops Corner down to 7th gear a little bit late on the brakes that uh, not the best exit but still, we're still looking good now. The S section, maggots, backheads, and chapel. A little bit miss uh, too wide here on uh, maggots and uh, no, no backheads. I think that was chapel. Not the best exit because our um, line was quite directly losing two tenths to our, P our PB there in that sector. But if we nail here, Stowe, no, we do not. Far too early, bro um, broke far, far too early uh, for, uh, for my standards. And now the last chicane, let's nail that. No, a little bit too much oversteer, missing the apex very, very heavily, and that will compromise our exit, exit speed massively. A 130.4, losing three tenths to my PB in that in that last sector. So that was not an optimal qualifying lap. P4 in the end. Our teammate Klawitzki with a very, very impressive time in P1, but. He got a warning for the game for um, uh, once uh, cutting the track and that means unfortunately that he ha uh, will get a quali ban for the next race. So that's unfortunate of course. But still he's in pole position in front of FD. Shadow beating us by 7 thousandths of a second. That also not too far behind in the same as Big Z and Maxson. 8 drivers today that will not... Um, yeah, we will. I mean, I think I think the maximum we can get in the next races are 10 people or something because we're only 10 people left in split one, which is unfortunate. But still, we have uh, three, um, oh no, six, seven drivers who are very, very close together in some races. So that will provide a good race. Um, hopefully, also here at Silverstone we have a dry start, but that's a little bit cloudy looking. Should be it would be nice if we have um, a a dry race at least after three races in a row where it's rained at least a little bit. We had a good start here off the line, um, right behind FD. Shadow goes on the outside of turn one, and we are going on the inside. FD got gets marked here. Oh, and behind us, Fat and FD are colliding into into turn three. I think they both both lost uh, several uh, uh, much time there, especially Fat who is now at the back of the field. So that's not re uh, not very good stuff. Oh. Mass Shadow and Skloot going side by side through Brooklyn's championship leader and my teammate. Oh, that was cool. very going giver coming very very close together, but uh, but Klawitzki stays in front for the moment, and we just try to hang there. Uh, as I said before, practice went went very very well. Also um, with uh, Klawitzki, so she, we should be good here to uh, uh, fight for the podium positions and the win in the end if we can uh, do what we did also in practice. Coming a little bit nearer to Shadow, but again missing that apex in the. Back hits. It was something I uh, had quite struggled, uh, str uh, struggled here um, in qualifying and the, uh, in, the, in the early stages of the race. And again, that's going side by side through stove, but no shadow can can't hang it around the outside of our teammate. Uh, but still, he gets the cut back, the switch back. He make it round the outside here. Still side by side. I'm lifting a little bit. I should have done that because I could have got to run here and shadow um, to the start finish track, but I didn't. And I have to go a little bit off the throttle because he's not very uh, fast through that first corner. And that last Azame is to catch up and go up the inside. We're tapping a little bit shadow. They're having contact. Azame is almost spins and we. 
I have to stop our account entirely and now Big Ziggy on our outside and oh he spins because on his screen I tapped him but um yeah and when I saw that I was just ah uh, that's not really good not really good I mean I didn't touch a Big Z on my screen but uh, we went very very close together in that co corner and when he started to spin I, I was entirely sure that was that, that that was my fault as there's carnage here with FD and Big Z again and we're making up the position on Big Z and now um, having the slipstream of Fed will, will put us surely side by side with FD, FD now through, through Cops corner it's maybe not an overtaking location but we're going for it Running quite wide, but still side by side here into the into the SS. I think we will let him go. Yes, we do for the moment, so uh, that we can attack him here uh, on the hangar straight. Good exit is of course uh, important. We did that as well. Should, should uh, look good to overtake him again. And I have the outside line for Stove. He's still hanging right in, in on my inside here, so we have to leave him room, but. Move is done, P6, and that was, yeah, I mean, still, I, I'm still quite ragey about that uh, incident on lap 2 uh, here in uh, uh, on in turn 3 and 4. Very, very unfortunate. But, we're uh, skipping to lap 5. We're right behind Fat, and Magnus is actually um, in a good 4th uh, position at the moment. Our teammate is still leading in front of Shadow as they is a little bit dropping back at the moment, but nothing too far and uh, not too far. As Fat now tries to make a move on the inside of Magnus. No, they touch and they go out of the track, and that's the next incident here, including uh, where F uh, Fat first is, uh, uh, is, uh, is in. So, very, very uh, unfortunate race for him. Very, very, uh, yeah, he will lose so so much time and on lap 7 um, with Azamus and Big Zero we are the only three who didn't pit yet and Azamus goes into the pits we are going into the pits as well and we will uh, put on the prime tires now Big Z stays out for another lap I don't know if that is a good idea Shadow got past our teammate. He's on the pro uh, he's on the option tires. Uh, uh, Shadow Shadow's on the option tires, so he will start to pull away now from everyone else. That's his task. But he can defend that position in the last. And so two stop strategy is uh, quite sure the strategy to go here around this circuit. So three stop is not really uh, um, good to do. And one stop uh, is mm, only possible if you're really really taking that risk that your tires are blown up uh, that you're getting a puncture or something so we're coming um, out in P8 Magnus in front of Fat still so let's uh, let's see what we can do now we have uh, quite free um, yeah we're not having uh, not really having cars around us so we should be uh, we should be uh, able to find our rhythm and Pump in some good laps. 4.8 seconds is the gap to Azamus. We try. We can close it in the next 10 laps or something until we'll we will uh, pit on lap 16, I think, for the option tires. So until then, nothing really happened, or uh, at least until lap 15, nothing really happened. Um, you can see here the dots and behind Fat first is. Uh, catched us, uh, all, all, almost catched us because he's also on the option tire, so or he's going for the same strategy as Shadow, um, option, option, prime, and you can see Shadow's not that far, um, no, no, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, Shadow all, already pitted so for his uh, last pit stop one lap earlier, and now Fat goes into the pits for his last pit stop so we, he will have the undercut but he's on the prime tire so that undercut shouldn't be too huge but we still have to uh, complete one other lap or two other laps I'm not uh, one no two two other laps sorry lap 6 lap 17 we didn't catch his name unfortunately he will stay out for another lap and we just uh, Look where we are coming out in, 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 in relation to Fat First. We'll be very, very close. 
and we have uh, and we don't have the advantage of the option tires so we should if we overtake him or stay in front we should be able to pull away shadow at the moment still leading this race as big z and the same as have to pit again and our teammate is maybe five seconds or something behind him so he has a task to catch shadow but that's possible it's really possible i think so and that pit uh, that pit, that pit box is so 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 long and where are we coming out right in front of fat but he's may move uh, around the outside here yes he's breaking very late with the fresh tires and there he goes by us for the moment at least and we're on plus uh, almost one plus lap of uh, what? plus one lap of your made that mistake as well in uh, in the last video but I'd say the tires should be up to temperature right now in this uh, corner here in Brooklyn. So we should be able to attack Fat first very, very, very quickly. And I was not really comfortable. I mean, I, mean, I was not... Um, despite um, that incident on lap 2, I was not really fast. I was not that uh, consistent and not that clean and not that... Uh, yeah, just not that fast. Um, as it was in practice, as you can see also by my lap, uh, fastest lap, a little bit of cutting nerves. Again, not a really good line here through um, the S sections, but we catched up to Fat. And now, putting up to Rich Mixer with the RS. He has quite low wings actually, I'm, I was running 3 1, so maybe that's what that was a little bit high for the straights. Having the outside line, no, we are not making move yet on him. Klamutski sets the fastest lap of the race, so that's very good to see. He's still battling for the lead for his first win of the season, actually. It's um, quite surprising that I already have two wins and here does not. We're getting a nice switchback on Fat first. Now have the inside land for turn one. Now he's still side by side. He's still there. Yes, he's still there. He's uh, holding it around, around the outside. And now we will have the inside land for turn three. And he's turning in. And we do not turn in. And that's the next incident and that's just i mean of course he just wants to give us as little room as possible to take a tight line through that corner and i could have um turned much much earlier into the corner to avoid that contact so that was uh, definitely not his fault that uh, mistake from us but again very unfortunate i was very disappointed and Again, not a good line here. Again, cutting and then missing the apex completely two laps later. FD sets the fastest lap now. And uh, Fat now made that mistake and we're catching right up to him again two laps later. And we have a very, very good exit out of Stoke. Can we uh, uh, be going up the outside of the last chicane and we are holding it right the outside and have the inside line now for the last corner and make that move stick that was quite surprising that i um was able to pull that move off i uh, just i thought okay okay let's uh, go on the outside for that uh, left hander and i didn't really uh, expect that i could bring it hang it there around the outside that was uh, maybe one of my best moves of the season and now we should be able to pull away, although our tires are not really, really looking good, but we actually were not able to do that. To, that, to do that. He's still in the RS range on, on lap 24. And we're missing that apex completely again in the S section. I was just messing that up completely in the last stint and also uh, in, in the race uh, in general. That's where, where I lost so, so much time too much time and now he has the inside line for though we have the outside line can, can we have the better traction and the better exit yes we do we can defend from fat first for the moment but now, now our tires are starting to go off a little bit and he has not the fresher tires but uh, I mean the, uh, the primers are not going off that quickly so maybe he has still a chance here to catch us on 35 is definitely not in that lap I want to make uh, his name is 10 seconds now in front, so there's no way. It's the only battle here for fourth position at the moment. And yeah, I can also report that my teammate Klawutski overtook uh, Shadow meanwhile, so he's looking good for his first win of the season despite that uh, messy, messy qualifying, but still. 
he had very very good practice and a good tire well also in yeah and so that will be a deserved win for sure after he had a couple of pole, pole positions this uh, season which is not really in this um his nature actually to be good in qualifying and uh, do not uh, uh, do not uh, cannot uh, repeat that result in the race so that's uh, quite interesting but we're starting the final lap fat still very there so we have to watch out and have the good exit out of the corners that matters the most for example this one here we had a good one putting on to rich mixture we have a little bit of fuel available to use in that on that last lap so that's very good last time through brooklyn's a little bit late on the brakes but still still um okay last opportunity for fat is of course after the s section so we hope we will not miss that up like uh, as we did that in uh, on last 24 that would be very very annoying cops corner last time this time in sixth gear taking that very good and now last time this beautiful S section, a section that very, very under the area of the, with the 2015 cars, but still an enjoyable section. We did that well, but that is not too far off, so we have to watch out here. As a teammate crossed the line now to win his first win of the season, uh, to get his first win of the season, and congrats to him. Fat is trying to make a move up the inside here, very, very late. Breaking from the Ferrari driver, but we're taking that position again. Very late breaking from him, but he's not going to make a move here into the chicane. No, he does not. And we, we will prevail with that slight extent here on the last corner. P4, at least P4 after that. Uh, yeah, not really happy with that race, but quite lucky that we... Uh, but still, um, do you think that we... Um, Catched up a little bit in the championship to Fat um, due to that result. Our teammate again taking his first win, uh, victory of the season. The championship leader Shadow extending that lead uh, in second, same as in third. Big Z in, uh, finally in sixth. And FD after a very unfortunate race, after he had such a good qualifying and only in seventh, and Magnussen completing the field in P8. Fast lap also goes to FD. Drivers' championship. Um, yeah, Shadow still leading 20 points in front of Fat, and I'm 12 points behind um, the Ferrari driver. It would be catching a little bit up, so that's very, very good to see in the driver for the drivers' championship and also for the constructors later. Zamus right, be right behind DH, Copa, FD, Magnuson, Big Z, Ken, Gorilla, Big C, D, and Sneaky still in last position with no points and no um, race attended, and that's. Also take a look at the constructors maybe in a few seconds please. Dum 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 dum. Hello? Yes, here we are. Ferrari leading 18 point 19 points in front of the Sauber's we ah, 50 50 51 points. No, 50, 50 yes, 51 points of the Ferrari's. That's quite much, but you never know what happens. Um, if we get uh, good uh, good results like that, uh, surely everything is open. McLaren's in fourth, Mercedes Red Bull, fourth, India Williams. So that's it for Silverstone. Hope you enjoyed the race. Next time out at Hungary, Magia Nakedic, <laughs> as, it, as it is called, uh, among the drivers who do not uh, spell Hungarian. And I'll see you there. Bye bye.